Hi, boys and girls. It is Friday, which means very exciting news. Drum roll, please. It's time for the spelling test. Now, I bet loads of you thought, Mrs Chand, you are not going to give us a spelling test because schools aren't even open. But unfortunately, boys and girls, we're still going to be doing it because we're going to be testing our knowledge of our phoneme words and our common words because all week I know that you've been working hard to spell these words correctly. So go and get a piece of paper or your daughter, get a pencil, write in your heading and the date and write the numbers 1 to 10 down the side. Once you're ready, you can then play the video again, okay? And we're going to get started now. So word number one is chorus. Chorus. The chorus in the song is my favourite part. Chorus. Word number two is chord. Chord. The song sounded bad because I played the wrong chord. Word number three is choir. Choir. The choir sang a lovely song at Christmas. Choir. Word number four is anchor. Anchor. The captain of the ship asked his men to drop the anchor. Anchor. Word number five is chemist. Chemist. The chemist gave me my medicine. Word number six is any. Any. Are there any chocolates left in the box? Word number seven is a long. Along. Everybody in our class gets along. Word number eight is body. Body. Why did the skeleton not go to the party? Because, because he had no body to go with. Body. Word number nine is story. Story. I like to read a story before I go to sleep. And word number ten is carry carry. I carry my bag to school. So you can rewind the video to play back any words if you need to and now let's go through and see if you got any of them correct. So word number one, chorus. Give yourself a tick if you got it, a wee dot if you got it wrong. Chord. Doing the same thing again with the tick or the dot. Choir. Anchor. Chemist. Any, a long, body, story, and carry. So give yourself a tick or your dot and give yourself a mark out of 10. So are you happy with your score? If you're not, you can keep practicing, okay? Practice makes perfect. And one of the best ways to learn how to spell words is to keep practicing and writing them down. If you got 10 out of 10, amazing, well done. And for everyone, big round of applause for practicing these words very, very hard this week and for completing your very first digital spelling test. So well done, boys and girls. Keep up the hard work and let me know what score you got. Bye for now.